How to highlight data in a table. You have a couple of options. First option, the most popular one. Insert an oval shape over the relevant data. However, avoid this method as it can look amateurish. Instead, try using a rectangle. It's more symmetrical, but make sure to place it evenly along the borders. To achieve this, you might want to zoom in by holding the control button while scrolling. Other options include formatting the text or the cell of the table. These methods can be effective, but today I want to show you something different, something more spectacular. Watch this. Insert a rectangle over the relevant data. Insert another rectangle that covers the entire table. Expand the second rectangle, but first bring the smaller rectangle to the front. Now select both rectangles and be sure to select the larger one first, then the smaller one. This order is very important. The larger one first. Go to the Shape Format tab, choose Merge Shapes option, and select Subtract. Change the color of the remaining rectangle to black, and in the formatting panel on the right, adjust the transparency. Select the rectangle with the hole inside, go to Animation tab, and click Fade. What's the effect? It looks really nice. Using this trick, you can highlight a single number, you can highlight an entire column, or you can highlight several different numbers in your table. The key is to focus on one item rather than the entire table. By the way, presenting a table without any formatting isn't a great idea. It's often better to convert these numbers into a chart, at least for the most important row or column, and show only a small portion of the table. But that's a topic for another time. Don't forget to like, comment and subscribe. See you soon!